setting Bradfield up right from not even day one, sort of day minus whatever it ha might happen to be in the planning life cycle as a place where people recognise inclusivity. I think that's a fundamental need for somewhere that's going to be a destination place. We really want this future city to be a city for everyone. So we thought working with the World Pride team very closely, we thought the Rainbow City project that World Pride is leading was a really good opportunity for us to do so. I loved seeing the drone footage showing the progress flag. These are important symbols of an advanced and mature city that shows a level of celebration around what we're doing. Having flags and the colours of, of World Pride, of the, of the queer community, are ways of saying to the people that visit us, you are welcome. To know that visitors coming into Sydney can look over the parklands and their first welcome to the city is going to be those freedom colours and that beautiful installation. Like what a, what a magnificent thing to do and how, um, what a magnificent way to welcome our visitors.